I, listen, it's, it's going to be an amazing movie. Um, And one of the films that is constantly being mentioned, and I, I don't know where you are with it at the moment, because uh, it feels like it's been gestating for about two, three years, maybe, which is the, the Hulk Hogan biopic, right. which uh, you're writing with uh, Scott Silver, Todd Phillips, yeah. and Chris Hemsworth is set to play Hulk. What's going on? Where are we with that? I mean, look, man, I'm so terrified to say anything about that. I don't know what I can say. I would just say it's going. It's it's. The material's great. Everybody's great. You know, um, Scott, like I said, we've written a bunch together and, and he is just the fucking awesome to work with. And Todd Phillips, who I've gotten to know, they're great. I, listen, it's it's going to be an amazing movie. Um, I don't know when. I mean, look, I, I, that's not a movie I think you can make with COVID protocols because, you know, there's wrestling scenes with like, you know, 20,000 people. Um, so, I, I mean, I don't know how that's going to go, but uh I, I, honestly, I, I, if I was a betting man, I would say it's going to get made and it's going to be a fucking great movie. Yeah, I, you would keep getting drip fed by Hulk Hogan himself going, Chris Chris Hemsworth's in crazy shape for this movie, which seems like, you know, you just sort of go, when is Chris Hemsworth not in crazy shape? That's know, like, right? <laughs> that's a weird thing. But, but there's yeah. like, there's Marvel muscles and then there's WWF muscles. So I think it's a, it's a whole other thing. Yeah, uh, but I imagine it's good having having Hulk Hogan himself uh, involved in making a biopic of his life. Oh yeah, absolutely. I mean, that guy is like an incredible resource and and not not afraid to tell uh, all of the the gory details. And I mean, he's a natural storyteller, as all those guys are. It's an incredible world. I mean, yeah. To me. And, um, and and this one seems to have gone away. This is where I ask you for like, but there was a period where you were, because uh, I know I, I spoke to Matthew McConaughey and he's like a crazy Evil Knievel fan. And I, I remember there was this period where you were writing an Evil Knievel movie where with Matthew McConaughey uh, yeah. potentially as the lead. Yeah, no, Scott and I, that was another collaboration we did. It's in a phenomenal script, um, you know, I don't know what the latest is with it, but again, I don't know how much COVID affected it or whatever, but like, I, I dude, I love that script, man. I hope that gets made. I mean, sometimes you write a movie and you're like, oh my God, I'd see that. Sometimes you're like, it's cool, man. I hope I gave you what you wanted, but then you write shit and you're like, oh my God, I would fucking die to see that, which is what I'm trying to write more these days. But uh, that was one of them. And look, knock on wood, I hope that's made too. I, I love it. That's I mean, crazy. It, it's cool having great shit out there that you like. Hopefully, it gets made, but it's you know it's frustrating, but it's uh, it's also cool, man. That's yeah. a badass movie. <laughs> well, I can imagine, especially when you've got a leading man like in McConaughey who was like, "This guy was a fucking legend. I love this guy, and I, I want to play him." You know, I mean, how else are you gonna find him? You know, the, yeah, he's great. He'd be he'd be perfect. I mean, who the fuck knows? Hopefully, like I said, knock on wood. I mean, all we did is you write it and you put it out there and. They gotta figure all that shit out. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I it sounds like potentially though, once this COVID thing finally goes away, which it it will do, it will go away, and we'll get back to a much more normal than we are now. You're gonna be really, really fucking busy. <laughs> Hello, Alex here. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to get in touch with us at all for any reason, you can find us on Twitter and Instagram at JTF Pod. And don't forget to subscribe to the full audio podcast on Apple, Spotify, or wherever you get your pods.